First up at 11, take a look at this ambulance left on its side after colliding with a Ford Fusion. Everyone inside is okay, but the driver of the car, police say, hit the ambulance, now cited for running a red light. Our McKenna King is at the crash site. She spoke with the driver who says he believes it was him who had the right of way. That driver was traveling through this intersection here at 15th Street and MLK Boulevard, and he says his light was green and that the ambulance didn't have lights or sirens on to let him know that they were approaching. I was just trying to figure out why I'm at fault. Tampa police confirming the ambulance did not have lights or sirens on when approaching the intersection, but they say Eddie Bennett ran a red light, hitting the ambulance, causing it to tip on its side. Bennett, however, claims he had the right of way. My light was green. He says he wasn't even aware an ambulance was approaching because no sirens were sounding. I could have lost my life behind you not doing your job. All you had to do is have your sirens on. Somebody would have heard you. Tampa police writing Bennett a citation for running a red light after they say a witness told them Bennett's light was red. I know that the dash cam going to say that. I didn't. Now Bennett is asking police to check dash cam and traffic light surveillance footage. He plans to fight this. All I need is my name club. I don't want to be judged for nothing I ain't done. That ambulance was carrying a patient, a family member, and two EMTs. TPD says no one was seriously injured in the crash. We reached out to Tampa police to see if there's any traffic light camera footage at this intersection and have not heard back. Reporting in Tampa, McKenna King, ABC Action News.